unfortunately our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces hoping it will all somehow stay away, but I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. suggests it's going to be a 4-5-1 formation, Jim. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. Away. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Vincent Company. He's such a complete central defender, physically dominant, very tough in the tackle, and a fierce competitor. He's also an excellent leader and organizer, and he'll contribute to their all round defensive game. The opposition forwards might be in for a, a tough time here. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Bremen were imperious when the two sides last met, and the fans are asking for more of the same. And it's Piatti. He's picked him out. Hits one! Good run, lovely take, but that is where it stopped. That's a real shame, Peter, because it was beautifully worked. Took the defence out of the picture, but he'll be in no hurry to watch the replay. Philip. And here's Osako. That's a bad place to challenge. What's he giving? Now the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. He's trying the shot. They've played it short. Delivers across. Shot at goal. Dashing forward at pace. Going through. Real chance! And that would have been some goal. He was set on rounding it off in fitting style, but he couldn't make it fit. Well, I suppose it wasn't the worst attempt if you consider how far out he was. Made sure that that won't get through. Hoists it forward. 
Philip. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Osako. That's a foul. It could be a penalty. Uh, the referees decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. He's gone for goal! <laughs> Shakes for an overhead! It's off target and by quite a way. Telly. It's an entertaining game this. Both teams have had chances, but it is still nil-nil. Forward it goes. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Giuliano. Osako. Oh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. Philip, and here's Osako, he's through the middle, and that's a foul, three kicks been given. Forward it goes. It's anyone's ball. And it's played forward. And it's half time here. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goalless. Gets things going for the second half. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. And he's cut it out. Hoists it forward. Philip. Giuliano. Tries to get it forward quickly. Just brushed off the ball there. Tries 
to locate someone up front. Philip. Gets it back. And the counter is on. And it's Locatelli. Good ball. Well read, he sorted that out. Tried to play it through. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. He's played him through. He gets past his man. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Big chance! Tries to He'll try from distance. He's had a shot! Just couldn't stay down for it. Hamburg seemed to have deployed this as a tactic, uh, a tactic that may need reconsideration. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. He's himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. There's only one word for this. It, it's baffling. That team needs to figure out where the ball needs to be, and it's not there. And helps available out wide. And that has been cleared. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here although there's still a chance for oh real danger here chance chills one in Jonas hit long and direct Ball's loose, who's getting there? Bremen really look... And that's that! And it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. Little craft or guile or penetration. Defence is largely untroubled. It's goals. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even. No complaints. With that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.